Oh my gosh. <laughs> and then I started leaning into the double like <laughs> <laughs> You look crazy. You <laughs> Oh my gosh! Yeah, oh, wait, are we live? I, I, I don't know. Are we? Yes. Okay. Jeff just turned. Yeah, I just turned it on. Just it on. I can edit. I can edit it out if I need to. We turn it on and we just go. We have Michael back with us. It's been what you said a year. It's been a year. Yeah, I think. I think last time we talked, it was like. You can raise that up if you want. Okay. If you want, if, if you need it closer to your mouth. <laughs> well, we know I like them closer. <laughs> now That's tighten good, it right up. There. Go oh, ahead. It up. Squeeze it shut. That Squeeze little no, shut. just hold here, right here. This little lever. Ooh. Listen, you're really Listen. good with the sticks. Oh, I do am. I need to leave I've the been room? using <laughs> one. <laughs> Forty-five years. Oh um, yeah, but last time we talked, it was like, it, it was okay. So coronavirus. I think the I don't even know if the lockdown happened yet. I don't know. <clears throat> well, because that happened in March, right? Something yeah. Like um, I, I think that I came and cause I know that I had gotten sick and I was like, I'm feeling better. And I had come that weekend. It was like right after I went to Vegas for work. Last you brought week. your rodeo rodeo. You're like the, wasn't it the rodeo oh, like yeah, podcaster and you're all online. prepped out. You had your preppy oh, shorts yeah. and your preppy yeah. shirt. Yeah. Is yeah. that when I served you too much wine and you were rolling around on the floor? Yeah. You were rolling <laughs> around in the floor. Was. And we got Megan to come and Leah. Leah was here. Wait, was yeah. that the same yeah. time? Yeah, yes. Leah was okay. here. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Oh, my God. It's crazy so much has changed. I'm so mad I can't I can't drink wine right now with you. I know. Because okay. I'm on a medication that won't allow me. And I have until, when is it, Wednesday? Tuesday. Tuesday. Wednesday. like that. Something like that. I mean, it's okay. I don't care. Like we, but that's the thing is, like when we get together, like we don't. Oh, you don't need it. It like definitely will amplify, like and make us loosey goosey. We're but family. Sure. We can are, be. Are we? Yes, we can be stupid without drugs. Can we? You yeah. Just, you just farted in my bedroom. I sure did, girl. I was like, you just I just farted. Hold <laughs> and I the scary, lied. the scary could've, thing was, is you're working on something and you couldn't make up your mind whether you're going to poop yeah, or I did fart in front of them too. In in the, in the room. <laughs> just can't it's so much fun you're always fun to have on the podcast oh you got to me up girl oh, I'm and, and, and to hang out with i missed so, it I'm but you don't we don't hang up out enough to i know well i mean i want i want us to like that's the one thing that's unfortunate is like we our hangout has been this right which i want it to be more than that but um and that's one thing that i'm lacking we have to like I always forget because remember when I come here, I try to be like so organized and I'm like, okay, I have subjects I want to talk about. Right. I like re listen to everything. I'm like, right. why was I like that? <laughs> yeah. Well, because I don't know. We You've just got an organization on, problem. We just, no, it's not a not problem. Not really, though. That's not a problem. Well, he really. talked about that before he. Mm-hmm. we. No, he, no, I, I get it, but. I think you have a you think you need to be organized problem. Yes. Probably. There you go. But I think I wanted to talk about things and, and remember them. Yeah. So I was trying to like like hammer in that I need to talk about this, this, I this. I guess you're this. saying. Yeah. 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 See, I don't I don't have that. We just turn on the microphone and go. I'm with just it. like, well, somebody will remind me of something. Yeah. If we need to Why'd you remember. look at me when you said that? Because you're the one that'll remind me of something. I micro manage so many people in this Girl, family. I know you want to be done, don't you? Sometimes, Seriously, just like, can I, you just fucking do what you got to do? Yeah, she does. She that's just, how I feel right now. Yeah, like, in my just, life. why do I need to tell you this? Like, She's like, I just want to get on Hefe. Oh my gosh! <laughs> She's like, can everybody just be done? Go to bed. Dear Lord, oh my God! <laughs> yeah, listen, hey, listen. This is this is for you all out there. That that the loyal. Um, what do you call call the homies? That listen to the podcast. Do you have anything for them? No, we don't. Our you bitches. Know? The closeters. The closeters. The closet cases. Ooh, the closet, closet cases. cases. Like yeah. yeah. Listen, hire me. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So all three of you that are listening, <laughs> you are uh, the closet why cases. Why do you do that? <laughs> you talk negative about the podcast, and I'm about to fire you. It's so good, I'm too. kidding. The podcast is good. Is it good? It is. I listened to it, and I was like, it made me, like, I, it made me really yearn to have you all back. I was like, I just love our conversations. Yes. And it's good. It yeah. is good. We like conversations. Yeah. We do. Yeah. And we're, we're, I'm kidding. We I keep the stats. I got the stats. I was going to say, you're a hard Thousands. Uh, thousands oh of listeners. <laughs> thousands. It's ungodly amount of people yeah, listening to this negative. podcast. Yeah, don't be negative. You want to know something? I need to hold your motherfucking ass accountable because, bitch, I know what the fuck you want to do and you didn't do it. I know. Remember, you know what I'm talking about? What was that? What? Exactly what am I going to talk about? about stand-up comedy. Yes. I know. Oh. You're on it. Uh, Why I got did a, you take the plunge, baby? I got a job. Oh, here we oh, go. Angie, here we go. Angie's always want to have sex. I can't oh even my. focus. 
He cannot help himself. He and cannot. I got kids. We forgot to give. We forgot to give a. You're uh, right. Um. A, what a is it? Disclaimer. A, yeah. Disclaimer yeah. on how King Hefe is. Yeah. He's filthy. Yeah, guys. I'm so not filthy. For you all out there, listen. This motherfucker is so <laughs> like. All he want to talk about is sex. Every time we be in the middle of a conversation, and then we'll go, well, uh, um, uh, yeah, she likes to think that too, and uh, you know, I wonder what this would. Blah, 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 blah. I'm like, if you don't just like, boy, I, I know the testosterone. I think you need some estrogen. <laughs> I, I live with estrogen. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. He does, and it's even gonna grow by one. So welcome, <laughs> welcome, welcome. Um, so what in the world have you been up to? Oh, Lord, have where do we mercy. even start? First of all, I want to start on how your streaming and everything has just like, whoo, went yes. crazy. Yeah, it's it's nuts because if there are people out there that like are like that watch me a lot now, I don't know who's watching, but um, a lot of them don't like they don't understand where my head was, like, or like how, like. Tumult, how do you say it? tumultuous the yes. journey is yeah like when you're very unknown yeah. like how difficult it is to stay like motivated and stay inspired and like keep your eyes on the prize it's so hard right it, it must be i don't understand that oh wait just okay. always being known is a is such oh a, my gosh yeah. so, he cannot help yeah. it <laughs> he really can't he can't i'm kidding i haven't been known yet Yes, you have. Look at you, you with that. your 26K. Uh, You're listen, balling out. What do you have on TikTok? Like a few. No. It's you got TikTok. like 20 something. 26,000 on TikTok. See? I've been on 26,000 since October. Yeah, I, well, it You happens. know what my people have done? Huh. They've stuck with me, but nobody else has come on board. They've been like, Ugh. I took a break from October until just like last month. I, t I was gone. And she's yeah. still around 100,000. No. No, I'm not. Oh, 95. Well, 95. Well, that's not. You're at 95,000 on TikTok. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, and you took a break. She no took more a break. breaks. She took a long break. I took a long break. And, I, and I'm not even really all that active anymore. I'll do something here and there. But, you know, it it was overtaking me, I feel like. It was making, yeah. it was affecting my mood. Why? Like, when, why? like, the algo and all that stuff. The algorithm yeah. pissed me off because it was like, you know, you grow, 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 grow. And then it's like, skirt, skirt. Yep. No more for her. Yep. She's done. Yep. It's like, and yeah. that affected me, and it made me mad that it affected me because mm -hmm. I don't like stuff like that to affect mm -hmm. me. So I was like, you know what? Peace out. I might be back. <laughs> took you a long time. <laughs> be, uh, 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 I don't. Uh, and I did. I did. <laughs> <laughs> <Hey -ya! laughs> Karate chopped me. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, karate chop a motherfucker. <laughs> I, thought it, I thought it was Ann trying to whack me off. <laughs> Next time that does happen, all I'm going to do real quick is go, <laughs> and, oh and that's God, session, no. session over. Session over. Uh, is session over. No karate no, chops. No, but, but in I'm all seriousness, you, your stream, like, because I, I watched it. I don't, I can't say I sit there and watch it a lot because yeah. I, I don't. I'm not a gamer. Like mm -hmm. I don't even know what you're talking about. You just make me laugh. Like it's so hard. <laughs> I got in there today. I was cracking up. But you, I used to, you know, tune in here and there, and mm -hmm. it's like grown so much, and it's yeah. awesome, and it just like flows. You know, it's just it's just really really good. It yeah, and it's there's a lot like a lot of people don't get like how much work and how much of a toll it takes on you because yeah. you talking about what it is that it did to you is what it does to me every day. Really? And I have to learn how to live with it. Really? And accept it. Like, there are streamers that will turn, like, there's something controversial, and it's, like, controversial to admit to, like, people who watch me, and I try to be vulnerable and paint a very realistic picture to them with everything. So, like, I told them I'm on Lexapro. I'll take antidepressant now. Right. I take it. I told them about my journey with, you know, um, ADD, all that stuff. Uh -huh. I don't care. I'm, like, I'm not, I don't want to be one of these influencers that... Always post positive things right. because my life is far from that. Right. Like I have six bad days and then I have three good days. Yeah. You know, so it's like I want to be very realistic in that when someone decides they want to take that journey, what that means mm -hmm. and what it looks like. Mm -hmm. But also so that when they come into it, they may come into it a lot better. Mm -hmm. So that's helping a lot of people. I mean, hopefully. Oh, that's helping yeah, a lot of for people. For sure. Hopefully. Because I, I, I love uh, creators that I follow, on, whether it be on TikTok or wherever, 
that are real that I see one minute they're living it up and they're the they're they're the badass they're the they're the person you want to be not be but you want to have that type of influence and then you see a post where they are depressed they're down mm-hmm. and they're trying to tell people this is what real life is for me yep you know what I mean mm-hmm. and it goes okay so I don't have to live on this in this cloud where I'm My above everything yeah. all the time yeah Mm-mm. right yeah because so, yeah so many things have changed and like even like the success of the page right now and all that stuff it's like it's still one thing you remember how i was like talking to you about how like i went from that job at maxim where i had like those like suicidal thoughts mm-hmm. and i was just like in a very bad place and i get that other job and i'm like oh this is great and maxim like, magazine mm-hmm. maybe can you get me a subscription i'm gonna get you this i'm gonna i'm gonna put my booty on there so oh you bust gosh. wide open it'll be bust open bussing oh my, my booty be bust wide open <laughs> 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 bussing <Hey! laughs> sorry i interrupted <laughs> Yeah, Jeff, right. And so good at it. Especially, I oh, Lord. Yeah. I, uh, uh-huh. Put you in time out. Yep. Put you in time out. Time out. Anyway, you um, went. But yeah, so <laughs> so it's like, yeah, I don't even know where I was. You said you I'm went so from working at, at Maxim and did, having yeah. these thoughts. Did you know going- that I had a Maxim magazine subscription <laughs> in college? <laughs> And they, they canceled it. They wouldn't take it anymore. Do you remember that? Congrats. No, I don't remember that. I'm really trying to <laughs> yeah, focus on it. the story. Yeah, get him. Get him. All right, go ahead. I want to go to Christian you? College. They cut me off. Mm-hmm. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, you're done. You're done. Okay. You went from Maxim, working, it, having horrible thoughts to... The other job. And remember how I told you it was like a roller coaster because it was bad there. Get this job. Great. But then I had that little setback, and I was like, what is mm-hmm. this? I think, and then it was the ADD with the, psych, or the psychiatrist and all that stuff. Uh-huh. And then we go down that rabbit hole, get diagnosed. Good. Then it's like, okay, well, still, there's something that's not here. So then I get this, and I'm like, this is great. It's all about what I do. I'm building this. This is all me, and that's going to fulfill me. And now that it's booming, I'm still so unfulfilled. And I'm like, okay, now i got to figure out what exactly is it? Is it finances? Is it personal relationships? Is it career? Is it like education? Is it traveling? What all do I need to be to be 100% fulfilled and my happiest state? I know that happiest state doesn't equate to 100, like 365 days happy. Right. But like definitely more than I'm unhappy. Like I sure, want to get yeah. there. Sure. So um, now I'm trying to find that journey i'm on that journey um and so much so that like i was having like really bad days and it's like you know what? i just think i need an antidepressant so i get talked to my therapist and she's like yeah i do think you're probably a little depressed um here and there because like i'll have these days where it's like it'll it'll stretch it'll be like i'm manic my mom was like really concerned because i'm like i want to work 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 i'm inspired i'm excited yeah. <laughs> I'm just all over. I'm working till five o'clock in the morning, girl, and yeah. I'm waking up at ten, going live for these motherfuckers. It's not good. Oh my gosh. And, yeah, that's and, not good. And like on. Yeah. You know what I mean? And then you know what I mean? It's like it, it feels good. I'm right. like, I don't need to sleep. I'd be tired, but I'm like, ah Yeah. I'm ready. Yeah. And well, then, you don't need to sleep if you're taking Yeah, certain- but I'm not taking it. You're not taking it? No. And you still are that yes. hype all night? Uh, yeah. I quit taking it too. Yeah, I want I'm gonna start taking it again. But I'm gonna figure out the right balance. Right. There there's gotta be the right balance. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. It can so be dangerous. Like, yeah. yeah. So I'm like, what what is going on? Why why do I have these extremes like of like I wanna do nothing but work and all night long yeah. thinking about things to get bigger and better and more creative and all this stuff, like where I'm literally, I'm like on fire. Yeah. Like I, I'm on fire. Yeah. I'll take calls and it's three o'clock in the morning and I'll be just, and I'll last days. Wow. And then I'll have, and then it's not like it'll like immediately revert. It'll still be like, okay, now I'm in a little bit of normal state. Right. I'm good. I'm good. And then it'll be like crash, boom. Really? And I'm like, just, I don't want to do shit. I don't want to stream. I don't want to talk to anybody. I don't want, like, I want my blinds to be drawn. I want to stay in my bed. Hmm. I, like, fuck the world. Why am I still here? Really? Yeah. Ugh. It'll be that extreme. Wow. Yeah, that, and I'm like. That's a right? real crash. Yeah. And depressed. Yeah. Is it? A, it but you exhaust it. yourself. That's what I'm saying. Is you it an exhaustion? You suck the life out of yourself. Is it an There's exhaustion? There's no balance. Right. I don't know. Or a depression. Like, what is, what is that? That's like... I don't know. Yeah. And I'm tired of it. Yeah. Because it's really hard to, like, pick myself out of it. And 
they don't get they don't know it you know they they don't know that and because when i come on they ain't gonna sit there and watch me when i'm like that right um they're not going to want to donate they're not going to want to support me they're not going to do any of that so everything will be hurt if i show that so, right. I ha- so it's like it becomes really hard when i'm that <clears throat> far right and i have to act it right it's really hard to have a job where you have to be on like that Uh, Mm. because i've had the job where you go to an office and you sit at a desk all day and you can be sorry i need to take my birth control pills um for reasons not Not really (laughs) for not for that reason but for uh, some other issues anyway but like you know you go you so you had a bad morning you had a bad day the other day and you can go into your office you can shut the door and you can kind of do what you want to do and you Mm -hmm. don't really have to talk to people but when you have to have a job where you have to always be on such Mm -hmm. as you're streaming i'm a personal trainer therefore i have to always be like hey guys yeah how are you and i'm also a mom and, and moms are kind of expected to be uppity all the yep. time uh-huh. because if mom's upset what's going on the whole mood you know what I mean so I, I feel like I'm responsible for like the mood of the household almost mm-hmm. and like I need to be you happy are. I know because if I'm mad and I'm mean and I'm upset and I'm mad everybody is going to be miserable it's, it's not mm-hmm. fun no <laughs> it's not mm-hmm. it's not so, but I, so I, I'm just trying to say I understand it does suck the life out of you to always be on yeah yeah you need more balance yes and I'm not to figure that out it's hard like, to figure out well this is one problem that I have is like I get like so many messages on the page, so much so that I've got my mod, like one of my mods, which is like people who in the community who come by a lot, you mod them. Right. So you understand that I had that, on that for a while on TikTok. Okay. Yes. To explain to everybody here. Right. Yeah. So what a mod is with a stream and on TikTok is like someone who comes by this, who comes by, you know, your content like enough that they believe in your vision, believe in what you do, like have a lot of respect for you and they want to be involved and help out. So my mods with Facebook, they take over like messages so they keep the chat so when you say the chat flows Mm -hmm. that's because i have people in there that care enough to keep it flowing right because if i'm like i'll like be doing hysterics i'm not reading the chat exactly so some people get mad about it which is frustrating but like if i so like if no one's doing that they're just watching me but they're not engaging Mm-hmm. So the mods will be like, okay, what's the, blah, 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 you right. know what I'm saying? Keep it moving. Yeah. So that's mods. So now one of them will handle all my messages. And if she needs help getting back to someone, she'll ask me. Yeah. You know, so it's just like, it's, it's, it's a lot. You Do know? you have a bouncer mod who's like, get him out? Like you call on like, hey, Gino, get him out. Nope. You nope, don't have a bouncer. You just let him be in there. That's, you? that's me. Like, be, yeah. let, I like that. Okay. Mm-hmm. Because because there are people that are supporters of my page and stuff like that that um, they what would be the word like hate on you. They well they're that before they were a supporter or a follower they <clears throat> came in and said some nasty stuff. Like there's a guy who um, who called me what the other day he was like what did he call me he said like. He came in, he was like, shut up, you fucking fag. Or something like that. It's just Ooh. like, it's like really like jarring when you hear that right. language. Uh, yeah. Like yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're just like, ugh. But like, I'm not really offended. That's hateful. You know, like, I'm like, okay, I don't know who you are. You know, but like, I want to be in control of how to handle that. Because if I allow the chat, the chat, they might ride or die. They're going to come, you know, and they're right. going to try That's and true. figure That's that out. True. Yeah. But, they can get out of control if you don't check it. Mm-hmm. So I want to be in, in charge of that. So what I do immediately is this is what I did to this motherfuckers right here, right here. I was like, Pedro, why are you lying to all these people? You've been messaging my page talking about you want to see the booty. You listen. This motherfucker, this motherfucker has been messaging me talking about he want to bust my booty wide open. He talking about the booty pig, talking about kiss me on my forehead. I'd be like, Pedro, I can't do this right now. You're messaging me at 4 a.m. in the morning. You're interrupting my sleep, baby. I just can't do this right now, Pedro. He's like, well, I ain't asking you if you want to do it right now. I want to see the booty, baby. I'm like, well, we can't keep doing this back and forth, Pedro. I mean, you got to figure out what you want. Do you want it? You don't want me? You want to call me the F word? You want to see the booty bust wide open? What do you want, Pedro? You want Text me at four o'clock in the morning. What do you want, Pedro? What you want? Yeah. Oh my gosh. So what happens is he was like, he started laughing. Yeah. And I, he was like, man, he was like, I didn't expect that. Right. So I'm like, listen, I forgive you, bro. Right. I'm like, this is what we gotta do. Is like 
we cannot transform energy, transform our spaces if we're just giving that same inner that negative yeah. energy back. Yeah. You know, it's like that's just like feeding more right. feuds and perception. Sometimes that sometimes that's easy and sometimes it's hard. I had somebody come into my um live one time and what did he say? He said, Wow, your transformation is amazing. Like you're no, you're transgender. He was calling me a transgender. What Right, what did he right, say? right. He was like I can't remember, but he basically said you're a dude. Yeah. He basically said, Wow, you don't even look like you used to be a guy. Something like that. And I was just in a particular mood that day, and I, I forget how how did I respond? I don't know. It was, I was, like, it well, was out of character. You. I was like, <laughs> right. you know, like yeah. I tried really hard, you know. Mm-hmm. And then he did the same thing. And then like we ended up being buddies. Yeah. And it's, so he would come onto my chat and say, How's my transgender friend today? And then everybody started getting mad at him. I'm like, Oh no, 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 no. We're boys mm-hmm. now. Yeah. We're friends but now. Isn't that like funny? it's a joke. Like it's a joke now. It's like an ongoing joke. Yeah, but isn't that yeah. funny when you give grace when it's not deserved? Yes. Sometimes and a lot of times, because a, a lot of times people, when they act that way, they're, they're miserable. Right. I say that all the time. They suck. But their life hard. sucks, but man. They, the- they, you don't come in and attack people well, right. if you're not miserable. You stay out. Like, I, for me, if I get into a live and I'm like, this person's a freaking idiot. Mm-hmm. I'm not going to say a word to him. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to immediately get out, yeah, right? Because right. I'm, a, I'm a level-headed, right. reasonable adult person. Rather than sit in there and be like heckle them, mm-hmm. well, it makes and, no and sense. No, it you got to have a problem if you're going to freaking bother people. But on the other end of that, if you're having a particularly bad day or feeling some type of way about yourself, and somebody comes on, and this is my last live on TikTok. This was my last live when this happened, and I and I was and I knew I was thinking about taking a break anyway. But we, I was on a live, and there was quite a few people on there, and everybody always the fa- the the biggest question I got two of them: Are you married? And how old are you? And I said, this one guy said, how old are you? And I said, 45. He goes, wow, you look a lot older than that. And that upset, like any other day, I'd be like, okay, whatever. But that day, I said, okay, I'm taking a break. And I literally just turned it off. And everybody starts messaging me that knows me. Wait, are you really leaving? I'm like, I'm done. I I can't let somebody I don't know affect me like that. I can't do it. I have to shut. When this starts really, when somebody I don't even know, it could be like a seven-year-old kid. Mm-hmm. I, why is it bothering me, Angie? You got to take a break. Yeah, but you can't say why. It's it's. I mean, it's reasonable why. Yeah. Because like it's it's like it's kind of like mini traumas. Like, and plus, like when you're just having those days that you're vulnerable. Yeah. Because we all have those days. When sure. We're vulnerable, Absolutely. Yeah. You know, like that it can penetrate those defenses that are typically natural. Think right. about it from like you know an analogy would be like your immune system. You right. know, when you're depressed, it's easier to get sick. Right. You know, so. It's understandable that it can happen. It just right. sometimes it's going to come in. It's going to let it happen. Yep. Same thing that happens to people out there. There are people who follow my page. There's someone that's a follower of my page that's been there since, like, it's been hard. Still here. But this person does not get when to stop joking. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm done. Like, I'm tired, and I'm not going to chase you. Right. Like, if you want to leave now, go ahead. But I'm not chasing you no more. Because, like, right. I told you already. I even I've been on the phone with this person yeah. before. Like, I, like, stop with the jokes because text, I can't. Yeah. figure out yeah, 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 and yeah. neither can people right so like you're you're poisoning this right so they keep doing it i'm like i'm done right so but it's like so you have to put in like counter like defenses right when you know that you're going to be down like that right you know That's because good, like yeah. your presence is good yeah. in those spaces yes yeah. you know so it's like you have to figure out how to live there right that's sustainably true. right exactly mm. exactly so ever since i've been back on tiktok i haven't done any lives really maybe well, one. i think it's it's important to cut those i mean I, I think it's important to cut people out of your life yeah sounds harsh but it's not i mean you can't hang on to people you can't say people so if if somebody bothers you and you're not attached to them and you can't fix it you can't have a reasonable conversation you delete them from yeah. your life and mm. if that's on social media Mm-hmm. You just ban them. So you're can- going to cancel the person. You cancel that person. Yeah. You don't even ca- from your life. Absolutely, you cut people out of your life if they're negative. Mm-hmm. I've always told my kids that too. If they're negative and they're be- you just cut them out of your life, and people are like, "That's harsh." No, you just cut them out of your yeah. life. It's hard for me to do that. I get very. I have attachment I, issues. I have attachment issues. She too. has attachment issues. I, I want to go ahead too. and take it real quick. What we can? Yeah, y'all can yeah, carry go on. Ahead, I gotta go, ahead, go take go my ahead, pill go because what are, what are we doing? 
I'm gonna go take my pills. She gets like her, girl, her her baby girl pills. Right, but I do have attached. I, I get attached real easy too. Yeah, I can tell you. But no, I agree. I get what you're saying. So I want to understand like your perspective because your perspective is completely different than mine. Whereas I get very attached, and I'm like, well, I love everybody. I love everybody. But it's like it's hard for me to be like, go on. I I it's I can't really do that. Well, but but people manipulate. Like the, what you just said about this person. I oh, see. Yeah. I get to I breaking see, point. I see them, but I see them as taking you to breaking point. You should. You should never got to breaking point. Yeah. They manipulated. They manipulated you into that breaking point. They're getting the attention they want. They're sucking the life out of you for them. It's mm-hmm. not about. It's not about you. Zero percent about you. You understand? Mm-hmm. Like everything that person's doing, joking too much, pulling too much, needing a phone call, needing a text. That's not about you. That's about them. Mm-hmm. And they're sucking the life out of you. To feed them, yeah. But and guess what? They'll continue to do that, yeah, for as long as you allow it. I get that, but like, this is where I go. Is like, I understand that those people need help. You know, like mm-hmm. they, they, and and I do like to be the helper. I do. Well, but and that's a point, that's a whole like, nother. Yeah. yeah, it's like yeah. to a point. And, but are you capable of helping? And I don't mean that in a mean way. I mean that in a way for me too. Am yeah. I capable of helping this person? Maybe. Maybe, but I'm not capable if I don't understand boundaries. Mm-hmm. If I don't understand that when they go to here, I can't go there anymore. Yeah, I don't care. Tell me you're going to do something like this or that. That's a sign that you. Ne- I don't need to have anything to do with you. You're not going to. You're not going to control me ever. Yeah. Because if you try to control me, that's a that's a serious issue on your part. And mm-hmm. I can't. I can no longer help you if you're trying to control my behavior. Yeah. You know it's what I mean. That. That's when I say to my daughters, if they're if they're if their boyfriend's trying to break up with them and they say, I'm gonna kill myself, out. Oh yeah, like Goodbye, uh-huh. you're gone. Yeah. You're yeah. you're not on the hook for that. People that do that aren't gonna do that. They're trying to manipulate you. They're trying to control you. Mm-hmm. And I people will say, yeah. but what if? What if? It's them. What if? Yeah. It's them. Get away from that yeah, person. Like I'm telling you what, if I they'll make that threat, get away from them so you can have a happy life. Mm-hmm. I don't Maybe I just have gotten old and you have I'm no. Not but that, so- I get that, though. But, that, but that's understandable. <laughs> it's understandable, but yeah. w- but what about the smart people that do it in little doses and do it in ways that yeah. they manipulate in ways yeah. that you don't even but understand because like, it, you need to be the helper. Yeah, but it's and they like, sense they that just are those people, <clears throat> and it's like you you should never be like upset by getting like taken by someone who's a shitty person. Yeah, like you, it's like always be yeah. proud of yourself that like. Maybe that you were taken. Be right. proud that you were because right. you were a good enough person to That's be. That's right. right. Yeah. And it's okay yeah. to be taken. I'm not saying it's I not. I fall in the same category. I just though. worry about the toll yeah, it takes, yeah, the, toll. the exhaustion, yeah, yeah, yeah. the toll it takes. It, it does. And, it, the, and the people that are missing the joy of having you as a friend because you're sucked into this hole mm-hmm. by somebody that, you know what I mean? Yeah. Not Maybe right. there's somebody that really needs you that will appreciate what you're giving them. This is really crazy because this is a trend like right now, like exactly what you're talking about is something that's happening like in my personal space right now, too, mm-hmm. which is a little awkward to talk about oh, because yeah? I was kind of hinted at you. But uh-huh. I mean, it just is what it is. I, I want I want to, I don't want to have to completely filter. I want to be able to talk about what's going on in my life. You right. Know? Right. You know, like I live with two 22 year olds mm-hmm. and it is like so hard. Guys or girls guys okay and they're also streamers okay. on the platform oh gosh and they probably people probably know Is that <laughs> like, but i mean i love them sure i love them one of I, one of them we're not as close to other like we're a lot closer but like it's like so oh, it's so draining yeah living with kids is it an apartment it's a house it's a house yeah so do you each have your streaming room, or do you have streaming time? Is times? it Storm and Chaz? Did they move? <laughs> oh my God! I wish. Woo! You be listening to Ride the Pony. <laughs> Get up on it, motherfucker! Woo! <laughs> oh, you had to. You had to bring up Storm and Chaz. I know. Good Lord, Storm and Chaz. Listen, guys. Y'all want to hear a funny story? Listen, listen. So. Chaz is beautiful. Yes. Chaz is beautiful. So I think I've told this story again, but it's like, it's probably going to be funny because no one's going to remember probably. It's okay. So 
Okay, you all don't know. But so Chaz is beautiful. He was the manager at Anytime Fitness that I worked at. And I'm not going to talk. They can hear. So um, y'all remember the story, right? Yeah, I think. Okay, okay. I, I'm trying to think of where you're going with okay, it. Okay, so I would see him all the time. But oh, my God, he is so fucking hot. Like, so cute, so sweet, <laughs> ambitious a little bit. Um, intelligent a little bit, and <laughs> yeah, yeah. why do I keep doing that? I just I like want to keep doing it. Hey, there was a one, two, hey, oh my gosh, you get me checked up. So, so I was like, I mean, you know what? I don't give a fuck. I like, I'm literally just going to like play my hand. So I walk into his office. I'm like, I mean, I don't know what you are, but I want to take you out to dinner. <laughs> oh, my God. I remember that. Yeah. And do, do you remember what he responded? He like? was so it was he was so uncomfortable. It was hilarious. Poor he was Chaz. like, he's like, I, he's like, uh, it, uh. <laughs> I thought he, and I thought he said, I don't play that way or something no, like that. He, he didn't say that way? No, it was really nice. Very respectful. I, I felt like he said something like that. Maybe it was I'm very respectful. Basically, he was like, um, he was saying that like, as a friend. Yeah, yeah. something like that. Yeah, he's like, like, but, that. he's like, but yeah. I'm not. Yeah. So he was very kind. That's, but yeah, he, he is I told kind. my friends <laughs> and they don't let me live it off now. Oh my gosh, that's so Although, funny. I think they forgot. It's been a minute. Yeah. They have not brought it up. I bring it up. So I, I don't know. I'm self-deprecating. I don't know. That's but, so funny. But, um, <laughs> yeah, anyway, I don't know how we got there. Oh, yeah, so we're talking about the kids. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, So yeah, they're yeah. just, I mean, I love them, but, like, they're young and, like, they're going through life, uh -huh. like, stuff that I went through over a decade ago. Right. So it's like... Why I craved you all so much, it was like I needed you all. Yeah. And I I realized I needed you all mm -hmm. when I was in one of my spells. Yeah. I was like, oh, because I just like crave like adult um or adult company. Right. Yes, you're an adult, what? baby. Yeah. 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 You're I made adult. it. You I made, made it. it. Uh, you, uh, so far. Yes. <laughs> Hi <-ya. laughs> That was that was poor. Remember when we do That's our, an adult. Like, our, our like Things we'll do a high off. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I have that on video somewhere. The the hand. Yeah. The <laughs> <laughs> well, karate, you don't remember every time I like to do like a yeah. A, oh yeah 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 yeah, 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 yeah. So karate chop. Yeah. Karate, oh my gosh, karate that's so chop. funny. I can't yeah. wait. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. <laughs> Why is your? You have like? Do you see this? His face is it's, flush. It's red. Yeah. What's wrong with I got you? Hot under the under this, and then all this excitement. I don't know. If he got hot because he's sitting between me and you, Michael. Is what he's talking. About. This is a uh, a this is, Zoa. I've no. got I've got a little I got a little <laughs> the rock. Fish. This is Dwayne the Rock Johnson. I've been sipping it's on him Zoa. tonight. This is right there. That's his. That's his energy drink. Well, I have his hat on and his shirt. Look at that. Yeah. Iron Paradise. We are totally the rock right now. Mm -hmm. Little little commercial for Dwayne Johnson and yeah. Zoa energy drink. It's really good, actually. It's it's pretty good. It does its job. The taste is eh, but it gives you what you need. Anyway, yeah. that was a little commercial break. That's okay. So um, they're just going through different yeah different different phases of life that I've gone through, and <laughs> it's like I I always like. I'm very proud of myself with how patient I've been because it's like you I'm, it's like you want your your home is your peace mm -hmm. mentally yes. physically sure. whatever and the thing is is like with content creators when one person's not doing what they're doing in a content creator house that mm -hmm. and we know they should be it right. poisons us all so we're not it, it, when we're down we have to make sure we're not bringing everybody else down and, and make sure that we're you know what right I mean? right and I think that I'm the only one that realizes that. Yeah, and I'm the I'm I'm over a decade older than them, so of right. course I'm way up here. Right. When it comes to those kind of things. Right. And there, so it's like I can give them what they need all day long, all day long, and I do, and right. I exhaust myself giving them all day long. Right. With anything they may need, if they it, you, and and it's not fair to say that they ask for it. Right. You know, it's like I feel obligated. Yeah. And and one of them not so much, the other one a little more so. And it's like I give, 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 but I don't have any of that for me. Right. I don't have none of that for me. Right. None of it. I don't have anyone calling out that understands what I'm going through in life that is calling a check on me and saying like, 
have you done this? Have you done that? What is this doing? How is that affecting right. you? Right. Okay, so you need to be doing this. I'm now mentoring you. I don't have fucking nobody doing right. it for me. Right. So it's like really exhausting to one, exert my energy for the stream as much as I do because I sleep all day to give them all my energy. Yeah, you got energy. Yeah. So it's like they get it all. Right. All of it. Right. And then afterwards, it's like to recoup, I kind of want to have conversations that are like right. my age, age, age appropriate. Sure. And for people to want to be there for me, but I also want to be there for them. So I'm just, everything is like, I'm giving, I'm giving everything. Right. Literally everything. And I'm not get like, I don't have anything coming in. Yeah. It's like, I have to manufacture that. Right. It's kind of like a nuclear plant that does not have the hydrogen. How are you, how are you giving that energy out? Yeah. How, where is it coming from? It's not sustainable. Right. No. It's so not. it's been, that has been really hard. It's like, I have to see, you have to sacrifice to have roommates, but at the same time, the sacrifice has to outweigh the benefit or the benefit has to outweigh the sacrifice and it's not happening. Yeah. So it's been, that's been hard. And it's also hard, like admitting that because I do want to be there for them because I know that I can, and I know that they can benefit from things that I can say or everything. I know they can, it's proven. Mm -hmm. So it's just, it's a weird situation. Yeah. That's tough. And exhausting. Yeah, I guarantee it would yeah. be. So you do need to recharge sometime. Mm -hmm. This is great. Yeah, I'm glad. <laughs> How long are you in town, by the way? Just for mm. the weekend? Uh, probably until like Monday. Oh, good. Monday morning. -ish. Good. Good. Yeah. Maybe that'll give you time to like relax and like. So do you stream when you're traveling? So I'm making it a point to do it right now. Just I want them to be able to get to know me in a better way, and I do try to do this while I'm live, but. This is better. Yeah. It's like we're going even further. Right. You know? So do you stream other than just doing your gaming? Fortnite. Yeah. So I started doing what's called on Facebook um, Hangout. Okay. But so on other platforms like Twitch, it's called just chatting. So basically, you're literally just having conversations with people who find okay. themselves in there. Okay. I allow them to ask me questions. We may watch something. It just, it just depends. Okay. But I'm starting to do that a little more. It, it's nowhere like there's no balance to Okay. The, okay. Yeah. All right. I was just curious because I you're you're so energetic and you're so good on your game stream. I was like, oh, he would be so good to just do something like that. Like yeah. just sit and like because there you keep it going. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And that's what we did on TikTok. We would have lives, and that's all right. we did is just chit chat. I mean, he had like something on every morning when we were on lockdown, like when we had to work from home, it was like called morning glory or something. Morning glory. Oh. He did every morning. We were have we would, we'd be right in our bed drinking yeah. coffee and like talking to him, Aww. like literally in our bed. Yeah. And then I would, I would do at evenings we would do, we would do like games and like stuff like hangman and like, Pictionary and stuff like it just was like your little family. Yeah, that's how you know. And and there. I do miss that. But yeah. then I was so involved in, it and I had such a schedule with it. It was like then I started doing noon fitness lives. Mm. So yeah, you just went like, overboard with it. I got a real yeah. And then so. I keep getting requests for Hefe After Dark. Oh gosh, so Jeff will get Jeff will get drunk and then do a live. <gasps> it's called Hefe After Dark. See, After Dark. You, yeah. and I already know you go too far. Oh, he goes oh. too far. You go too he goes far. too far not having anything to drink. Can you imagine? If yes. He, like, yes. Yeah, I can. It's fun. I bet it's it is fun. It, yeah. It's fun until yeah. I'm like, time to go. Stop. She has to take it she and turns have to turn it off. off because I'm afraid he's going to get banned. Yeah. Which that's because on TikTok it's easy to get banned. Yeah. Yeah. I've been. I got banned once. And you had to restart everything? No, I mean, I got banned for a week. I wasn't allowed to post anything. What did you do? Um, I let Nate light a firework on 4th of July. Are you serious? Yeah, and I it was, was more than a week. I, no, it was a week. Was it a week? Yeah, it it was seemed a week. like decades. Um, I was on live, and we were doing fireworks on the 4th of July. My parents were there. We were there, his own parents. He's He was 12 at the time. And we let him light a, fa light a fountain. Like, I know, walked him out there and I let him light it with me. And we got Somebody shut down for age, that, like whatever. He was so too young to be lighting a fire. Too young to be. <laughs> isn't that like? Isn't this getting ridiculous? Yeah. People were parenting for us. It's yeah. getting ridiculous. Yeah. 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 It's honestly, and this is one thing why. Uh, so, and I don't, guys out there. I, so, I also, um, folks who listen to the podcast, I have my stream pulled up so that you know people can kind of interact with us too I'm, I'm not really reading their comments but sometimes when you say when i hear certain things like that's who i'm talking to but um i so i reached out to someone um with facebook just to kind of be like i wanted a clarification on some of the rules right without you know like me having a muscle shirt on and a booby coming out like yeah my, is my that gonna be okay nipple. sure yeah am i gonna get banned? Ooh, <laughs> in trouble right 
You know, so I just had like stuff with the and him. Yeah, people and him. like him. And him. I I've had clarification been... from him because he's so fucking. Yeah, period poop. He nasty. <laughs> I've been very clean this episode. Yeah, you have been so he far. Has been so far. Yeah, but like that's one thing too is like I I like a lot of people feel like we can't talk on Facebook about some of the things that are sensational mm -hmm. without getting in trouble and. I just I heavily disagree with that because it's like we are in a time that we all have to exercise, you know, our our right to speak up about things that we disagree with, but also at the same time, like not going overboard and influencing people to do things that are like right. bad. Right. But I think that speaking on what your truth, what what your truths are, you know, what whatever that may be mm -hmm. is important. Oh, always. I agree. You I know, agree. so that you know yourself. And that shit is yeah. fucking stupid. Right. That is absolutely ridiculous. Yeah. I I agree. It's ridiculous. I agree. It is it's, it's absolutely it, no, it's, it it's, is. It's, it's the dumbest. Like to the point that like it causes anger for people yeah. who aren't even involved because we all like see what's happening today. Mm -hmm. And it's like we're done. I got so banned for what two days or something yeah for talking about religion or i something. was talking about my grandfather i was like getting emotional like i was talking about my grandfather and what an influence he was in a religious way like mm -hmm. in a spiritual way like one of my very one of my few serious moments and my screen cut off yeah it was crazy and it, it was cut off it was for inappropriate content yeah and i'm like i was talking about my grandfather being a preacher yeah it was it's crazy. so and ridiculous how he influenced my life. somebody decided to say that you were talking about it who was knows. Not but like good, why whatever. why should those people why should people have that power? People people okay, if they find that they do not like it mm -hmm. or that it's inappropriate, leave or leave, get the fuck out. Right. That's like what to I've say your said. place. If why you do you don't you have like the power it, to fucking stop leave. me? Right, I agree. Like uh, what? I don't know. I, <laughs> I totally agree. It makes me crazy. It's insane. It, it is. is. It's like literally like, okay, so if one if that guy came into my stream who was calling me that, you know, mm -hmm. whatever, and um, he decided, oh, I want to be funny and I want to be a troll, report is inappropriate and I just get cut. It's like, what? Like, where does this line draw? Right. Like, and how does that happen that quickly? That's what I I have no know. idea. It's, I mean, it's, I was on there for a while, but it's like. That's all I was really talking I, about it really, with people when I was answering questions. And yeah, it's all of a sudden it's like how banned. they have that much pull. Like they don't even look into it. Like, has this guy that you're reporting, has he been reported more than once? Is this an ongoing thing? No, we've never. There should be like a three strikes and you're out or like something like yeah. that. Like, OK, you've been reported three times now. Maybe you are being a little weird by, yeah. by three different people. Or is this just one person on here? How, how, I don't know. But with all works. the things I've talked about on my life, oh my that's just what you freaking really yeah. ban me for. It's crazy, honestly. But yeah. anyway. No, yeah, we digress. But still, it's so important. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we were talking. Okay, so we were talking about like the kids. Yeah, having influence. How do we yeah. yeah, having influence. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anyway, that's what's happening. But you you wanted to ask about the career. Yeah. Because I, I feel like we kind of got gone all over the place. But yeah. Um, yeah, things have definitely taken off. Sure. Um, in a crazy way. I remember my algo, just yeah. like you, was like plummeting and it was mm -hmm. not recovering. I was like, it was very like mentally taxing. Yeah. Like November and October was such a hard month. Mm -hmm. Um, just because I was like, what's, I just quit my, like, right. Okay. I haven't got, to, we haven't talked in so fucking I long. Know. It's been a long I know. I know. God, it's I been know. so long. I know. Okay. So like my, my algo was like going up. Going up, going up. And I unlocked like what's called supporters where people can subscribe to your page. Mm -hmm. And then like, I was like, okay, things are going great. Like immediately I had like over a hundred supporters. Like, and that was a feat, mm -hmm. a feat. Then 200, like the next week or something. It was crazy. It was just like, okay, shit's happening. And yeah. I'll go still going. We, I'm ready to like quit my job Yeah, and do this. So, um, I quit my job. Put my two weeks really in. yeah and but like i had a crazy story we haven't talked in so long no so no I we haven't i know it's so much <laughs> <laughs> that was a half a high uh, I, was, I, I cut I it off i don't know how you cut that I off that's like a off. sneeze like halfway through a sneeze <laughs> yeah. you can cut that off <laughs> no it's like there was i swear to god there was a sign there was a sign there was a sign wait wait a sign there was a sign i shit you not i love signs okay I should have brought it with me, but I wasn't thinking about it at all. I didn't even think it was about like it. It was like an actual happened. sign that you an put in your trunk? Oh. No. A, like a sign a... from 
wherever okay, the universe comes from. It about. was a sign from the universe. It's a big universe. So, okay, last year on July, was I think it was July 4th, there was, do y'all remember if there was a rainstorm? Wasn't there rain? Uh, I don't remember. Hit How would rain? I remember that? I just, because you, you're talking July? about the fireworks. So yeah. I was thinking about like, did I can't you remember, remember if it rained? I yeah, remember. no, I don't, I don't think Okay, remember. so it rained. <clears throat> and you were and still here? I, I was in Morgantown. Okay. So I went to Jess Godby's. Oh, yeah. We had people over, yeah. and I parked. So like, it rained. the The backyard was like flooded and nasty. But then we had come out. I got out there, and like, it was dry. It was drying. So we were talking, <clears throat> and I had to talk to somebody who was one of my was going to edit some videos. And um, well, at the time, I had shot some footage. I'm just, there were so there's so many things that were clicking at the same mm-hmm. time. So. I had shot footage for a video I wanted to make and I needed to get someone that could edit and put it together and make it flow. Mm -hmm. And, um, I just didn't know who I was like, I was like trying to figure out who that person was. I randomly, this is all going to come together. So I randomly one day raided someone. When you raid someone on your live, you end your live and you send your viewers to someone. Right. And I'll go over there and I was talking and I was like, I love them. And I was talking to them and then, I stayed like way longer and then I found out that he was an editor and he'd worked on fucking Billy Eilish's shit. What? Yeah, girl. No. What? Yes. Yeah, he had worked with her before. He's done all this stuff. That's what he does. Oh wow. Like videography. Yeah. Cinema, all that stuff. So it is it was crazy. So on July 4th, we were gonna have a talk. So I drove down and then I remember I was like, oh well, guys, I'm going to go have a conversation when he calls. So he called. I was walking, we were talking about, okay, yeah, he could do that, blah, blah, blah. And I remember getting back to my car. I come back to my car, I'm in the alleyway. And I'm just like, I like start kicking this rock. This rock is a part of the um, the road. Mm-hmm. And it moved. The rock like moved. And there was a piece of paper there. It mm-hmm. had been a thunderstorm, a rainstorm. Everything was like covered in water. Yeah. It was completely dry in there. And it was a fucking fortune. Uh-uh. It was a fortune. What did it say? It said, it said, okay, I got to remember the exact words. It said, um, those, it's those, those. Okay, I'm not going to remember the right words. Did I have take it a still. picture of it? I still have it. I have the actual piece of paper. Really? At home on my audio board. It says, those who, something, something those who, like, basically some people who want success or success comes by risking all or right. something like that. Yeah. And I was, and it was all while this was happening. And in my head, I was saying that, like, I was being held back with my job and all yeah. that stuff and not knowing. I was thinking about that the whole drive down. That's crazy. I kicked this random piece of the road. It moves. There's a fucking fortune there Say after how? a water storm, and it's completely intact. See, Jeff doesn't believe in stuff like this. Sure I do. No, he does not. Sure that's I called, do. What's that called? What's that's called, what? called fate. Fate. But that is like he doesn't like believe in fate, and I shit. I believe in it one hundred percent. You don't, and don't say you do because I'll go back and figure out what podcast we talked about fate, and you put it in the ground. Listen, sometimes I believe in fate. Oh, hey, my listen. God. <laughs> Get up and walk. Yeah, go talk to him. <laughs> Talk to him. (laughs) And that's fate. (laughs) Tell him, girl. Tell him. Sorry, I had to go talk to Michael. I always like to be the antagonist. Our our listeners that listen all the time know that Jeff is full of it right now. Listen, they might not. Somebody's got to 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 banter and be the pragmatist. Anyway, but I back to your story. I but I'm open minded. Love stories like that. I think it's amazing. I think things like that absolutely 100 percent. Happen and you have to listen to him. And yeah. I know you did, didn't you? Yes, yes. I was like, this is fucking crazy. I, me- I immediately start showing my friends. I was like, this, because like they've heard about it. They know yeah. where I'm at. And I was like, that's the sign. That's the sign. It and wasn't like you went to the Chinese restaurant and opened it yourself. You're no, like, all right, this could have been a coincidence, no. but that's crazy. So crazy. That's crazy. So crazy. Like, I was just like, this is like, it still gives me chills. I'm like, I bet. How the, so anyway, what happened next is put my two weeks in, right? Finally put my two weeks in. Okay. So in the middle of like, so like the two weeks was put in on Wednesday, right? I had a stream that morning. I had a stream that night. Great, great, great. Thursday, great numbers, great numbers. Friday, great numbers, great numbers. Saturday morning, great numbers. Take, I think I take Sunday off, come back Monday, 
Algo's gone. And I put oh, my two weeks in already. No. I'll go gone. I'm like, what the fuck was oh, this? Oh no. That's just a test. I was like, what the fuck? What? It was I was like, what the fuck? It was that bad. I was like, all everybody's gone? What what what? It didn't make no sense. Uh, over the weekend, over one day, everybody's gone. And they're just gone. That's crazy. So it was like having to rebuild my page. <laughs> you oh, know, while gosh. I put my two weeks in on a job that uplifted me out of poverty hundred percent and changed a lot of my life. That I still respected. Wow. You know, to pursue this endeavor. Right. And it did not come back, Angie. It did not come back. My algo did not come back until I wanna say end of December, beginning of January, and now it's like still coming back. That's I mean it's 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 way back now. Sorry, yeah. it's way it's way it's like things are great, but it's like for that long, it was from like the middle of August until the end of December. That's it was crazy. just like, what the fuck? It's a yeah. really good story, though. Yeah, it's crazy. Because you, you have to it. overcome <laughs> something, He's right? He's stuck with that. It was so fucking hard. And like, but you had to risk it all. Yeah. When it was tough. Yeah. It's one thing to risk it all when it's easy. When yeah. the owl goes there, but then when it falls <sighs> apart and you're still stuck with it. Mm -hmm. You, you could have begged for your job. Yeah. You could have gone back and said, look, I made a mistake. Mm -hmm. I want to you know, rescind that two weeks if yeah. you'll allow it. But so you are you did. still doing that full time? Needs to be like a, a coaster. Oh, you don't need a coaster. This is. This I'm gonna is go get a water in a minute. Well, I, I can mean, get you okay, a coaster. okay, well, in a second. Yeah, well, then you can get um, yeah. I'll get, I'll so you are you up. still doing that? You're still doing streaming full time? Yes, yes. That's awesome. And it's like, okay, so like, do you have an OnlyFans or anything to support it? Jeff, um, that is a I personal mean, question that you do not need to answer. Okay, I'm not gonna answer that. <laughs> I get reels up in here. I'm gonna answer that. I get reels up in here. I don't have OnlyFans. Did you have you bad boy? I didn't think so, but uh, I, you're such a you wholesome. Were hopeful. <laughs> I was <laughs> hopeful. You beat me to it. I was, I was like, I've searched Fierce Devo on OnlyFans <laughs> so many times. Oh, and you probably come up with some. And I've and I've subscribed to like twelve of them, but it's <laughs> never you. <laughs> Go get your water before you get, get in trouble. Your water, <laughs> uh, can, you get, can you squeeze back, you skinny mini? <laughs> I'm over here getting fat as hell. You get smaller. Oh, Is whatever. No, um, I'm good. I think I, I, I need like. Do you have any like any zero? Any pop zero? I have. I have Dr Pepper zero. Oh wow! I'll take it. You'll take it. Do you yeah. want me to bring the can? Yeah. Do you need some ice? No. Okay. He doesn't drink ice. We bring him water, right? Mm -hmm. you? Yep. Bring water yep. No ice. Mm -hmm. no I, ice. I, I like room temperature water. By too. the way, I want to tell you, I have that. You have I the got same this one? last week. I have it in my car, girl. Same car. In my nope. Mm -mm. Mine is like the blue and like uh, yeah, purplish. I, like that or like, I almost got like. that one. Her name's Winona. Uh, Winona Jug. Could you imagine putting <laughs> fucking wine? <laughs> <laughs> girl, I'll be living for the rest of my life. <laughs> I'll be fucking taking care of. Listen, when I'm able to drink wine again on like Tuesday-ish, unless I cheat and not take my last little bit of pills, so Monday or Tuesday, I might fill this up. <laughs> no, I'd be passed out for oh good. Oh, my God. I've had a bottle and a half before in one night by myself. Yeah, but there, that's way more. This yeah, is that's a gallon. A lit night. This is a gallon. Yeah, is that, so do you, is that really all we need? Pretty much. Depend yeah. I mean, unless you're some sort of crazy athlete. I make yeah. myself do it like this yeah. whole week. And it's like, I don't really know that I feel a difference, but it just feels good to oh, know that I'm I doing do. it. My skin is different. Really? Yeah. How long have you been doing it? A couple months. Oh, yeah. You Okay. Yeah. So I just started not even a whole week. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You'll feel a difference. Yeah. But yeah. I got to keep at it. You do got to keep at it. It gives you encouragement. It does. Read it's it. so cool. It is Feel so like you're cool. You're almost there. Yeah, to see like marks and stuff. That helps me. Yeah, that like not me. just the jug, but like uh -huh. not even the words really fool me. It, it's Get the me. it's, it's like the mark. Yeah, and I've really drank more than this, but I I had some sparkling waters that kind of count towards it, so I'm really probably done. Yeah. So yeah. So to tell you all what we're talking about is like so it's what are they called again? Like the all you these need are, today or something? Or these are like the inspirational water jugs. But aren't they? They're called something. It's like oh, the all you all all you need in one day water jug or something like that. I don't know. Yeah. I call Fair. her Wynonna. Thank you so much, sweetheart. You're welcome. You're so sweet to <laughs> me. Welcome, and you forgot to get a coaster. Oh, hold on. Men don't think about nothing like that. I know. They say fuck furniture. <laughs> Buy new. I fuck furniture. We don't need furniture. Let's sit on the floor. <laughs> My dad hates this too. Yeah, girl, get this way. Thank you. Yeah. So we're <laughs> he's chugging shoulders. He didn't care. He didn't. He didn't really care about. He yeah. didn't care. I didn't um, forget your zero. Oh my, he's so sweet. These I am. Just I'm so, sweet. These Perrier waters look how tiny. I know. It's, it's like they just screw you. It's like 
Like here, bitch, take a little sip. <laughs> 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 Buy another one, motherfucker. No girth at all. <laughs> so okay, so, okay, so we're the, caught the, up on job. Yes, yeah, so the fortune. The fortune. So the algo. So why I'm, do we say algo? Is that the new algorithm? thing? Algorithm. Algo. That's, that's a yeah. I've never heard it shortened. Really? No, I just he's not you're in old. the world. Oh, oh, I get it! I get it! I am. I'm old. Oh, I'm old. No, you're not. Algorithm. No, you're not. I know what it is. I just it's, it's the shortening of it. Algo. It's 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 yeah. weird. It to makes me. sense. No, because I, I hate it. algorithm altogether. Yeah. No. I hate it. I hate the word. I hate the system. Whatever yeah. it is, because it changes. Yep. Right, it's like I love it, I love it, I love it, and then it bends you over. Yep, and right. it makes you its bitch, right. and then you're like, I hate this. Yep, exactly. Right. But you just gotta hold on, like Michael did. Hold on. Oh please, to, don't. Oh, boy. to one more day. I was singing. Who is that? <laughs> We're having two different songs going yeah, on. Yeah, we right are. Right. <laughs> I'm singing smooth jazz. What are you singing? I'm I'm singing. Um, what what are those? What are those girls? The Why? sisters? There's some fat ones. The Pointer Sisters? No. You got to hold on to one more day. Oh. Wilson Phillips. Wilson Phillips, right? Yeah. <laughs> Again, one we're old. Gotta, oh. <laughs> Will, <laughs> Wilson, Wilson Phillips. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Um, Pineapple edition. Mm. Looks delicious. I feel, I feel so proper it when, is, I, when I drink the Perrier. It's very delicious, actually. Yeah. Okay, so your algorithm caught up, okay. and now where are you? So... The move to Algo. So one of the streamers moved into in, in with me in November. Okay. Um, I, I don't know if he's you know, if he's watching or not, but um, he moved in. <laughs> I don't even know who all's out. I, I don't know. I just got up in their face a minute ago. I didn't even read anybody's name. Oh, someone said stars. I think. Thank Ooh. you. That's money. Hey. Yeah, thank, thank you. Hey, yes. <laughs> 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 that's great so uh but yeah one moved in and um it was interesting getting accustomed to it because his personality is so different than mine really yes he's like a little bit of a recluse but he can come alive when he wants to and when mm-hmm. he needs to but um he's used to living life on his own because mm-hmm. of his upbringing and stuff. Mm-hmm. So it was really, it's like, mm, this is interesting. Yeah. And then we wanted to get down to the Carolinas. I wanted to go to like OBX mm. or like uh, Wilmington or something like that. He wants to get to Charlotte because of um, the connection to the server. It gives you better like play. Okay. When you play Outer stuff. Banks. Yes. Outer Banks. Yes. yes. I'm getting um, the hang and, of this. Well, and I, I actually I got forgot this. the name. I was like, OBX, I was saying it in my head. Right. Um, Bumper sticker style. Yeah. There you yeah. go. Yeah, I'm with you. So there were other, there were two other streamers that were talking about like going to Charlotte too, and there's a lot of other streamers that are moving there as well. So anyway, we decided to move in with another one. We moved in, and um, then things so we we get there, things are kind of okay, but like it was a little bit rocky because we're like we moved across the country a little mm-hmm. bit mm-hmm. and trying to getting adjust to that. And um, I think that a big help to my algo is one of them. His name is Mighty. That's one of my roommates. He's big. He was. He's already partnered. He's been. Par- he's one of the like fa- like one of the first partners on that pr- program, um, the first wave. And he shared my stream, mm-hmm. and I got ten thousand views that night. Oh wow! And after averaging two thousand, right, and one thousand, uh, it was big. Yeah, and then like it kind of stuck. That's awesome. So I don't know if it was like him that yeah. saved it. Yeah. Or it was a combination, you know, right. culmination, whatever. But things just kind of start going up. But I do think that a couple of days before that, I had like decent views. I can't remember. But mm-hmm. um, so then we go on a trip and we were like, we need a trip. We need a trip. So for um, for New Year's, we went down to Tampa to visit mm-hmm. another partner streamer who my is close with. Had a great time. It was very like motivational for us because we had that long talk drive it was nine, nine right. and a half hours but it was only me and mighty that went the other roommate stayed back and it was just very uplifting i streamed down there my views were still good took a break came back views are still good yes yeah. kept being good um got reached out to about partnership for the black content program That's on awesome. facebook where they're hiring um, black content creators and to kind of push back against what's happening in the world right now um, have a lot of respect for Facebook for doing that. That's awesome. And to also be a part of that was just huge. And it was like things were just lining up. And I remember driving down, I was like, 
no, I was like, this is going to be my year. Yeah. And I remember, I don't know, no way he's in there right now, but like there's a guy named Kingslayer on the platform. So Kingslayer is massive. He is like massive. Yeah. Like a celebrity in terms of um, streamers on Facebook gaming. Okay. Um, and he had come on my stream. He like liked it. And I was definitely shell shocked, yeah. but or shocked, but I never show it because I've had other people who've come by that are a little bit of a heavyweight. Yeah. And I'm just like, how I treat people, I'm like, motherfucker, what you doing in here? Yeah. So that's yeah. immediately what I do. I'm like, he ain't going to know that I'm actually shaking. Right, 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 I'm right. I'm like, because this is like big. Yeah. And so I immediately turn up the ante and I'm like, cussing him out. I'm like, what the fuck you doing up in this motherfucker? Yeah. You yeah. hanging out with the plebeians over here, motherfucker. What you doing over here? Huh? You think you just cool over here having yeah. fun hanging out with the nobody, huh? <laughs> yeah, looking real good over there, motherfucker. What you doing down here? You want to come over here and play a little patty cake, motherfucker, and then go back to your castle? What you doing? Anyway, he was like dying laughing, and um, it was like, I was like, I just remember driving down just like on that high yeah. of like and I remember telling him, I was like, dude, could you imagine if King wants to play with me? Mm-hmm. Zane's King Slayer. Like, can you imagine? He's like, dude, that'd be dope. That'd be dope. That'd be dope. And he's cool. He came by. He's like, he liked you. Yeah. That'd be dope. And we're talking. I was like, this is my year. Like, I, f- I said it and I fully believed it. And it's weird to believe that. I don't know why I believe that, why I said that, because the past four months were shit. Yeah. I had no reason to believe it. And you're going to still think I'm pragmatist over there. But it was like, it was a four, it was like I had this like supernatural clarity. And I was, it was like my brain was reaching out Mm -hmm. to something that was, that I have no business reaching out to. And I just, for one moment, knew that like it was going to be my year. And it just, I got back and it fucking took off. That's awesome. Like just, Take off, take off, take off, take off. You're partnered. All right, I had I had reservations. They talked to me. Partnered. You know, we're good. Partner stream hits. Someone fucking sent me 630 gifted subs. I'm going to tell you what that fucking means. I don't know if anybody out there remembers that, but this man, Mike Will, on my day. So they partnered me February 1st when they partnered the first wave of Black uh-huh. Content Creator program uh, for, in the program. Um, and it was my birthday, February 1st. Uh-huh. So it was double whammy. So I get partnered that. So he gifted me 630 subs. When someone su- subscribes to your page, it means they become a supporter. They give you five dollars oh, a month. Okay. He wow. you, when you are a so when you can gift subs when you become partnered. So he gifted me 630 in one day. So you do that times what? five. Yes. Wow. And then people were just like, "You got, you got, my, boom, 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 boom." I was like, God. Damn. What? Uh-uh. I was like, after all this, it was just like crazy. Like, I just couldn't believe it. I was like, what is happening? I wasn't prepared. I was like, I know this is going to be a big day. I'm excited. 100%. But like, I was like, just, whoa. That's awesome. It was like switched. That is awesome. I love yeah. that story. It was crazy. See, it's that rock. It's the message. It, it is. It, it well, it's 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 it wasn't, imbra- he wouldn't have gone Wait. there and he wouldn't have cut no, if he would not have gone there and kicked over that rock, he might not have ever had that like aha moment. The inspira- like the motivation. Sure. Yeah. But it, I think the the there's so much to the positive mindset. And I having agree. that attitude, this that is attitude. my fucking I year. I agree. I the agree. Attitude, this is my year. I agree, but to get the, him to that point. What a, and I, I'm with you. Whatever will get you to that point. Well, it, it was happened to be fake. Kicking a rock. Finding a a, a see, cookie, see a fortune. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, find a, a cookie. little cookie crime. You found yeah. a cookie. He it wasn't. It was. It was. It was dry. He does this thing with no, his mouth. No, I believe. Yeah. I'm with you. I'm with you both. <laughs> <laughs> How long y'all been married again? Oh, we've been married for, well, I'll tell you something. A week from today, we've been together for 30 years. Oh, so you know. Yeah, I 30 know. Years. Going shit over. Hey! <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> that is absolutely. Listen, I love the story. Can't wait, time I out. love the story. I don't know why you got to. I love the story. I almost believe in fate now. Oh, my gosh. Shut up. I, I have time out. Go ahead. These little buttons here, do you know their sound effects? Oh, he can't Hold hear on. them. Oh shoot! Oh, it's okay. What him. is it then? Well, I, we can record here. We can record. Oh, we can record a hi uh, Here, I would love to oh, if we could figure we it out the because we could program that in. I'll send you all of them. 
Um, which one's so which? Listen, I don't There's know. a horny one. <laughs> <laughs> we need the high up. We need, we need yeah. the high up. We got to get the high up. So hit, anyway, send us a, hit, send us a file with oh the high Oh gosh. Well, he might have it trademarked. Or just at this just point. send it to me via. You should trademark that. I should. I don't know if you can or not. I, I, don't know. I should. Somebody I might already have that. <laughs> that should be your intro sound. <laughs> on it. And me like doing a kick like that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just make a sticker. Like you sticker. Gotta like, you gotta like amp it up. You gotta gas the high. You gotta like rev it up. <laughs> you could sell hats. You could sell shirts. You could sell stickers of just you doing this. Yeah, I, 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 you know what? I've got to re- you listen. You all talked me into TikTok, and I didn't take it seriously. And I have someone like regularly updating shit, uh-huh. but it's like the algo never showed me love because it, it was like so long in between, right? And the stuff that I'm putting out, I was like, I don't give a shit, just have it out, right? But I, I'm planning on redoing it and doing like real, yeah. Like I, I'm completely making a new one, yeah. I need to do that. That would be great. You do. Like actually, that needs to be my thing. Yeah, because like. Hey! Yeah. That's right. I'm here, guys. What's <laughs> <it? Yeah. laughs> that is so great. I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> you should have heard him today. He was on mm-hmm. it. I, Brooke and I were watching his live for a few minutes. Because Brooke didn't know if she had met you before. And so I was like, well, I, I said, let me find him on Facebook. I said, well, he's live. Why is he live? You should be in the car on the way here. But he's live. <laughs> yeah, I'm not live right at four. Oh, that was Sorry. funny. But anyway, so... Sorry. That was great. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he got on the road a little late. And he chipped his tooth. Yeah. Um, um, so where are you now? Update us to wait. What's, okay. What's, so what's, well, not until you about King. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, we King. get back. This is my year. Right. I believed it. And that, that day went crazy. So anyway, like in January, King came by my stream one day and I like, I, like I never like I'm not like as good as all the other the other players are. So he likes to make fun of me. So he okay. came in and he was talking shit and I was talking shit right back at him. And this is before we really knew each other. But uh-huh. he had come back uh-huh. and um, some of his mods had made a relationship with me already. Excuse me. And um, so he was talking shit back and it was a banter. We're just kind of flowing. He's like, you know what? I'm have to get on on my day off and get and help you get to a victory. So he. It was his day off. He loaded his stream up and got on to go live and play with me. What? It was nuts. Are you kidding? Swear. That is awesome. It was insane. And like the the chemistry was like very like natural. Yeah. And um, then he like hit me up to play again. And play again. 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 What? Again. 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 Gave me his number because I needed um, help with about something. He's like, here, I'm giving you my number. Talked on the phone for like two hours at night. Oh my gosh. Like, you know, and like now he's like, like we have a solid friendship. Like through and through, that is my homie. Oh, that is so like, awesome. Homie. That is awesome. That's huge. It man. is crazy. Huge. That's it, awesome. It's, and it's crazy how you can form relationships through this kind of thing. Cause we have a we have a group of friends as well that is <laughs> Through, I honestly like. I feel like we're closer to them than we are some people in Charleston anymore. Yeah. Like right in our it's, own town, it's right. you yeah. can meet people like that, mm-hmm. and they live sure. all over. You know, Maryland, Ohio, yeah. you know, Delaware, wherever. And it's you can actually be good friends. They I, there's two of them that's come stayed here before. One's coming next month. Same guy. What he's been here a couple of times. But yeah, yeah. Like we're, we have them into our house, which yeah. is kind of weird, but like. Really they haven't close. killed us yet. Nobody's yeah. killed us yet. It could be. So, yeah. This yeah. is the third time. It could be the third time. Could be he's waiting. Could be Maybe he's been casing could it. it could you know be. what I mean? Yeah, yeah. it could be. But. That's kind of freaking yeah. a little bit. But anyway. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, that is. He's going to listen to this and be like, motherfucker, I heard you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, Stephen. No, you're not no she's not. <laughs> Stephen is not going to kill us. He's not going to happen. Uh, but if we end up dead, his name is Stephen. No. <laughs> exactly. Listen back to this podcast. I'm kidding, Stephen. Just listen to your podcast. Anyway. Yeah. Anyway. Um. What was I saying? So, no, you can make very yeah. solid friendships out of. Yeah, yeah. It, streaming. It, it was insane, and like, there, there's always this level like playing with him. It's like I had to, I had to, hundred percent because like he's very, um, he's very what sort defensive of you know his business, mm-hmm. and you you can understand why he wants to protect that. Right. So I, I feel like that I had to prove. That I could be someone that can, that he can trust 
the energy wise when he brings me in mm -hmm. and it was like there were tests i feel like not not intentional tests mm -hmm. but it was like you know once it finally started like being proven that like our chemistry was like solid it was like oh let's go yeah so you now is this a something? regular partnership? No, it just it makes sense. I mean, mm -hmm. you've got to trust a person before you bring them in and allow them into your world. Yes, that you built. Yeah, that exactly. you're living. Mm -hmm. It's it's how you pay the bills. To let somebody in is a huge compliment. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. there's got to be some some barriers to break down for you. Yeah, to get into that circle. Yeah, and it feels great that he does trust me because yeah. I understand like he has like. He averages, you know, anywhere between, you know, one and 3,000 people watching him whenever he goes yeah. live. So, so are, is this an ongoing thing, like a normal thing you all yes, do now? very normal. Probably we play, like, at least once a week. That's awesome. Um, live. And um, so, like, even when, when his algo was, was even better because now on Facebook, like, a lot of things are kind of, like, just wishy-washy. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. But he was having more people. So, it's like mm -hmm. to be able to invite me into that. You know, it's huge, and so I, it's like I'm forever grateful. Like I tell him how grateful I am. I don't, I don't know if he understands or if he knows how appreciative I am. But you know, and and for him also to like take me in, and it's just it's just crazy. Yeah. To be to like so many people want a piece of him. Yeah. So many people want to get in, and I know it's hard to kind of sift through the people who are there for the wrong reasons and who are there for the right reasons. Right. You know, but like for me to be that one. You know, and given that opportunity and not only given the opportunity, but like now for, you know, it's like I, I deserved the opportunity, but like it, so many people deserve the opportunity. Mm -hmm. But, you know, it's like me deserving the opportunity. And now it's like, oh, it's like this was more than a business thing. Now, this is like you, you are like a you're a friend like that. I like, you know, that I'll ask stuff to. And, you know, right. But you're genuine. I love that. So when he comes into your life, he could sense your genuineness. Yeah, there's something about you that's genuine you know what i mean that's like, very true you're a real person you're real you're not going to just like you said you you didn't just bow down and act like a fool mm -hmm. you know when somebody came in you stuck to who you were yeah and so i think that's people can sense that with their gut mm -hmm. you know yeah so i think that's what how is it you believe in gut but you don't believe in fate is what i want to know because your gut is real so it's fate we'll fight yeah. we'll fight Hi yeah <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't believe in fate. I'm just not overly romantic in the way of like I, I feel like you can be when you sometimes you can be manipulated. It's a whole nother podcast. It's, it's it probably is. It's a whole nother it podcast. Is. So it you is. can be if you're a hopeless well, romantic, you can easily be manipulated in silly ways. It has nothing so, to do with fate, but okay, whatever. Eh, fate, <laughs> hopeless romantic. All when this he stuff goes like this, goes when he goes like that. Eh. Yeah. 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 yeah, he's bored with it. Yeah, it's he's, he's, it's yeah. Fun. no, it's he fun. It's it's fun like to that. talk about. I like it. Eh. 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 Yeah, eh. it's um, something. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, back to the story. Yeah. But yeah, so like that's happened, and um, it's just like other things. Like now that I'm partnered, I have like more. Um, I have like there. I have I have connections now within mm -hmm. the staff and so like the, i feel like things are just moving and opportunities are opening and and like just life it, f like in every it, like professional professional wise like just doors are being like open that i never thought would have been open that's awesome and and like quality of life in terms of like you, finances or just mm -hmm. other stuff like that have changed and it's just interesting you mm -hmm. know like but at the same time I'm on an antidepressant, mm -hmm. you know, I'm trying to figure out like, cause it be, it's like, I'm giving so much out. Like mm -hmm. I need to figure out how to recharge myself right? and how to have a proper balance. And, and that is so hard because I know what I need is I know that I need like interaction, regular interaction, regular, like, you know, interaction with people that are in like different or, or similar head spaces. Mm -hmm. Um, and I do not have that. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I'm I'm still trying to figure out how to be my best self. Right. Always. Right. But you're going in the right direction, at least. And you'll probably yeah. do that forever. Yeah. Because mm. we always are changing. Yeah, everything's changing. And our changing. situations in our lives are always changing. You you're not alone. Mean? No. At all. And just when you think you got it figured out, life will throw you a curveball, like us being coming grandparents. You know, we, we had, like, a plan, and, like, 
what you know all the kids were almost out of the house we had one more left we were gonna move <laughs> it's like <laughs> hey hello uh, grandma you yes. know what i mean so things change so, yeah. so yeah. things change in your life so it's just like you said it's constantly an ongoing battle i feel like i have with myself and kind of the, it, he and i are a lot alike if you've been listening to him jeff since you know me so well, we're a lot alike. You it's are. It's crazy. Yes. Mm. Um, and your algos. And every, your, <laughs> algo, your algo problems. You guys have both had some algo listen, problems. Listen. And, Stay yeah. out of our algo problems. He loves it. <laughs> algo. He thinks that we're like being cool kids. I feel I feel so cool now because I'm going to totally go and I'll be like, you guys would not believe my algo right now. <laughs> How can we? You never heard that, and like, why you're fixating on it? Like, that's a cool. Term. He fix. He's fixated. You're on so it. fixated on that. Like, <laughs> he's you, gonna you do like, a TikTok about it. <laughs> Mark my I cannot word. wait to do an algo TikTok. Mark my word, there'll be a TikTok. I'll be like, about bro, him. my algo is totally doing me in, man. Because he loves the dad jokes too. Yeah, I do. So you oh gotta think God. of a dad joke with algo. Yeah, you do. I will. I'll figure it out. No cap. Yeah, no cap. Yeah. No cap. <laughs> okay. You like that one? Oh, oh I love the cap and the see. no cap. Yeah, you got to use so them great. right though. It's important. Yeah, the cap and the no cap. Wait. Well, what's the, what's the no cap? Oh wait. Oh yeah, yeah. Like no cap. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So okay, you're not cap. no lie. You're capping. Right. You're capping. No cap. Right. No cap. Right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I had to figure. Yeah. Yeah. Cap. But that's slang talk. But anyway, like so. fade is cap. Huh? <laughs> What? I can't stand you. So never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Why could I have not gotten that on video? Michael just looking at Jeff dead on him like, I can't stand you. <laughs> uh, we're supposed to love each other. That was the best thing I've heard all day. That was so funny because he was so, he was like, I can't. He was. He I usually just say I'm done with you. Yeah, I mean, shit. Did he text this the other day that I, I hate you, Jeff? I hate you. Did I say that? Yeah. With you, that cli- the clip you sent us. <laughs> where you oh, I hate you, Jeff. about you talking about something. No, I, I remember you talking about your lane. Wait, he the was lanyard. like, mm, lanyard. You yeah. were talking about you hate that girl with a lanyard. <laughs> I was dead. That sounds real bad to your stream. Like, she hates the girl with a lanyard. Yeah, I was there was dying. a story behind I was like, it. Oh, my God. He's just like, you're being so serious and typical, Jeff. Is like not, mm. yeah. and you're like trying to tell a story, trying to give it, and he's just downplaying it. He's yeah. just taking the energy um, out of it. Mm. He just, like, mm. she doesn't even tell me even more. Phase her. It she just keeps <laughs> going. <laughs> it honestly doesn't phase me after mm. these years. I got her. Well, I got her a lanyard. You all okay? We've talked a lot about me, but I mean, I guess your podcast knows all about you, but I don't. Like, I want to know what changed. Yeah. For you all. Oh gosh. Other than her, because you, you didn't even tell me she was pregnant. I thought you knew. She's pregnant. I didn't know. I just was like, It's okay. all over the FB. I didn't know. My FB is like all like yeah. gaming No, stuff. she is. We're going to be grandparents um, in August, beginning of August. So that mm-hmm. has changed. That's changed. Other than me doing e, e, e e-harmony. Learning, e-harmony. E-harmony. I'm on e-harmony now. That's no, I'm great. not. That's Good work. <laughs> um, no, but e-schooling with Nate and then trying to get Brooke to gra- graduate and she's having a baby. Maddie's in nursing school. Our other daughter moved in with her boyfriend, kind of. So it's just a house full of crazy. Yeah. And so I was said at the beginning, I micromanage a lot of people. And that's just basically what I do all day. I micromanage people. And then I train people. And then I also work at GNC part time now. Girl, I don't. Really? Yeah. I that's where I was know. tonight. Till eight. I don't know how you do all that. It's hard. It's not easy. It's like you said. It's like you just put out, put out. Put like, out, put and out. I, I know what he's thinking. Go ahead and say it. Oh, no, you don't. Uh-huh. Not that much. <laughs> I, I, I already know. I that. love that you <laughs> cut him off. I love because it. Because you knew he was going to say Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and then he, he just cut it. off for the joke of not putting out. That's good. He brought it all together. See, yeah. see how he is. It's yeah. wonderful. So, I like it. There's got to be a way to tie that together. That's why I was saying I can relate to him so much. So, kind of the same thing, but different circumstances. But other than that, well, how really Okay, but how, you need to tell me. I need to learn from you. How do you recharge? What do you do to recharge? I don't. I cry. And She's I got me. And I get upset. And I, I, it's like, I, like winning the lottery. Mm. It's, it's, it's amazing. It's like she would not be able to go on. I have won the lottery. <laughs> um, no, but I mean, I do, I do kind of like, but then it makes me feel bad because I put it all on him. And then I don't, I, I don't feel, I feel like he's the person that gets the least of me. Like I try to be the best mm-hmm. personal trainer. I try to be the best mom. I try to be the best GNC employer. I tried to say that with funny, fa- with straight face. You but do, no, I do. You do like, give I your all to everything. I try to give you my, really do. And so I feel like I try it's to exhausting. give my all to him. But at the same time, by the end of the day, when I'm sitting over there 
you know, with my wine and my adult coloring, because that's what calms me down, to be yeah. honest. It's really amazing. <laughs> yeah. You should try so, it. Okay, so you have a little bit of hobby. A little you bit have, of a you hobby. You have your routine at the end of the night. Yeah, and then I just, but I kind of dump it all on him, and then I get tired and fall asleep, and I feel like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, I feel, then I then I b- wake up beating myself up over that. Like, I'm not being a very good wife. I'm not being the best wife I could be. So then yes, I get all, are. like, upset and mad about that. So it's just like you can't, it's just, it's nonstop. So I kind of mm. get what you're saying, but. You beat yourself up too much. What? Do, okay. Well, I what do. do you think how about this? How's, there's a question for you. What do you think you can do to change it, to make it better? I don't, I, you, I don't know. Mm-mm. I think the summer will be better because then I don't have to help Nate with his school so much. Because okay, I have so to help way on hands be, with him. It, like what's going on in the world too right now. Yeah. Because like that can yeah. be a big thing that's taken off. Yeah. Of you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Um, and just you know, I don't know. I don't maybe know. win in the lottery. No, it's really not money. I mean, I, it, no, I mean, I, I, who wouldn't want to win the lottery? I'm not saying that. Of course, I'd want to win the lottery. I mean, want to win the lottery. Sure. Yeah, that'd be cool. sure. It would take a lot of, but it wouldn't change mm-hmm. the fact that I still need to be the best mom I can be. I still need to be the best wife I need to be. I still need to be the best because I wouldn't quit working. <laughs> yeah. Even though I won the lottery. <laughs> So I might work in a different capacity. I might do something a little different, but you know what I'm saying, right? So it wouldn't that wouldn't be an answer. Okay. So well, it's 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 partly comforting, partly concerning that that you can relate. Yeah. And you're you know you are my elder. Right. Sorry, I'm trying to say that. No, that's okay. It's fine. I am. But you know what I mean. Like he said, that, you old ass I, bitch. Well, it's like, it's like I wanna <laughs> I wanna figure it out. Like I yeah. wanna be like. But I mean, you're you're Don't obviously try probably to f- you're not on an antidepressant. No, so, like, I'm not. No. You are not. My, so so you probably do have it. Maybe your uh, your your pressure is probably way less than what I feel. Probably, probably because I I know I'm not on any type of medication um, other than wine every night. That's that's my antidepressant, honestly. And and we laugh about it, but it really honestly is like it's my relaxation. It's my chill time. It's it's my way of not needing to take medicine because it's not like it's not to the point where it affects my everyday life and I feel like I need to because if I felt like I needed to I would. Mm-hmm. You know, the doctor has recommended it before, but I'm just like, "Oh, let me just try to handle." Yeah. So, um so this whole week of not being able to have wine has been really interesting. I've done really really well, actually. You have. I haven't been, been I haven't been hateful. I've been no. a little bit maybe a little bit moody. Maybe a little bit. It could be PMS. It could be that cuz that's true. It could be, yeah. It could be that. Yeah. But anyway, um, so I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm waiting for the summer to see if just yeah. alleviating school helps. But I think that that's very, like, I, I think that that is, like, you, like, having to deal with, like, the pandemic and the, I like to say, so there's this podcast called The Read, and they always call it everything but the the pandemic. Yeah. They say panoramic sunroof, Panasonic battery. I love it. They say, uh, so I like to echo. That's <laughs> so great. I love that. Yeah. Whenever I'm on uh, stream, I'm like, God, I was like, we're in a panoramic sunroof and we don't have the gas to open it, bitch. <laughs> well, I need y'all to put the gas in the chat so we can open this motherfucker. <laughs> we stuck. We need some fresh air. That's right. That's so funny. <laughs> anyway, but like you, you have pressures that are generated you know, buy something that is completely out of your control. Exactly, yeah. So it's like, I think that it's safe to say that once that is alleviated, Mm -hmm. that your quality of life is going to be impacted, like, tremendously. Probably, yeah. In a good way. Yeah. 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 I think the the thing is, though, it sounds like kind of like you're looking for an answer that's going to fix everything. I don't think it's there. You know what I mean? And and I think another thing, like I, I was with somebody today and they were talking about, worry and and anxiety and what a waste it is which we can't always control it but it's a complete waste if you can control it so the only cure for anxiety because this is good for me because everybody gets anxiety and we all only know our own level Mm -hmm. right you only know your situation so nobody can say mine's worse than yours or worse or it must be nice or or it could be worse no it couldn't be worse this is what I'm dealing with in my life, and it's what I've got. You know, maybe it could be worse, but that doesn't make me feel any better, mm-hmm. right? Because mm-hmm. this is all I've experienced. So for anxiety, like the only cure for that anxiety is to take action. But if you can't take action, then you need help. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like like if I've got anxiety because I'm waking up and I'm avoiding paying something that I could pay, well, if I just fucking pay it, the anxiety goes away, Right. Does it? Because I'm sure this is you're talking from experience. Does it? I am talking from experience. Yes, if I can pay it. The problem is, is when I wake up and I go, "How am I going to pay it?" 
Yeah. yeah. The anxiety won't go away. So now I need some help. I need to figure out how to get that. You know what I mean? So you're looking for a solution. But in your situation, what you're talking about, it's like you're trying to figure out the balance. And it's just more complicated than just it's, finding a simple solution. It, of course. Is my point. It's like it's. It's like you've but got. But there ex- is one. I, you you said that you don't think there is, but there is. No, one. there is. There is. But it's I'm like, saying it's more complicated. It's than, definitely more complicated because it's like beha- It's dealing with behaviors that are like rooted, you know, to my the core of who I am as a right. person. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Like one 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 thing that I know that I struggle with is like I like being up late at night and like watching TV, whatever, and just like hanging out in my bed. Because it's like no one is awake, so I'm not getting inundated with like just whatever. Yes. And it feels so good, and I never want to leave it. Yeah. And even when I'm tired, I fight, and I stay up too late, and yeah. then here it is, four o'clock in the morning, and I got then my body, no matter what, won't stay asleep. Yeah. So then the next day is completely fucked, and I I, f- I find myself in that cycle a lot because it's like no matter what, I don't find the same joy. Mm-hmm. You know, like waking up early and doing it or something. Right. Because I'm like, okay, now I'm, I'm thinking about things I got to do. Ju- yeah, exactly. Like, oh, it's the stress. Yeah, you get that joy of having, right. your, having it done. You've and escaped to do. from stress. Yes. While you, I'm, I'm the same way. Yeah. Like I, I've yeah. told you that. Like I can't fall asleep at night because it's like I got to get up the next day. Right. And it just feels good. You got to have that. Yeah. You, you want to chill and you want to wind down and you don't want it to end because I know as soon as I fall, people are like, well, why don't you go to bed at 10? Get it's some not good that night. easy. No. I don't want yeah. to. You know why? Yeah. I know. I because as you. soon as I go to bed, I start this again. Yes. Right? I yes. start this mess of a day yes. that starts at 8 p- a.m. Mm-hmm. And I got to go in the office. I got to deal with the emails right. and the calls and the freaking Oh, my fires. God. Just you saying that, I was like, oh, I felt it. I know. Ooh. I just you, felt it. I'm like, oh. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah. your only piece yeah. is from 9 or 9.30 till whenever you fall asleep. That's yeah. Yeah, that's why. And we, I get addicted to it. And you fight yeah. not wanting to go to sleep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I and then it the ruins the next day because yes. you're so yeah. exhausted. Yeah. Because it's no matter what time you get, <clears throat> you know, you start your chill time at night. I have to have that wind down time. So, like you know, normally it's like nine to eleven. Well, I have to have the wind down time. So right now it's twelve ten. So whenever we're done with this podcast, I still need about an hour. Yes. I need yeah. about an hour to just do something. Like That's whether it's me. watch mindless TV, That's me. have my drink, which I can't tonight. If we're out but, till 3 a.m., I'm that way. We'll come right. home. I, I'll kick off so my weird. shoes and sit up for an hour yeah. just because I have to. Yeah. 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 100%. I understand. I understand. I, I'm weird. the same it's way. so weird. Yeah, right? I'm like, I ain't no way in hell I'm going to go home and get in my comfy-ass bed and go right to sleep. Right. Bitch, you got me tore up. Yeah. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> 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 Float like a butterfly, bitch. I karate chop like a bee. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so funny. We need to do a part two soon. So we funny. do. You need to come back. We do. Or we need to come so down there, much. over I there, love it. up there. No, you got down kids there. in your house. We got enough kids here. I mean, I you. All, I would let you all have my room. My room has its own. Oh bathroom. no, no. It's a master. I'm we kidding. just come over I'm to do kidding. a podcast. I would love it. I'm serious. I'm serious too. And we have an amazing backyard. Like we have, I like to call it the Lanai. Ooh, the Lanai. Because I back. love my golden girls. I love Ooh. them. And it is a nice back. Like it is beautiful. Listen, we need to schedule it because let's try to do it. Uh, because we, Charlotte's not that far. We can go down on a Saturday, spend all day Saturday, Saturday night, and come home on Sunday. It's not that far yeah. that we could do that. Mm-hmm. We can afford a hotel for a night. I it's fate. Like, it. like, It'd be fate. Shut up. No, that's not See, fate. That's scheduling. Here he goes. He just cannot help himself. He can't. That's called scheduling something that has nothing to do with fate. Yeah. Fate would be like if we decided to go on a... On a <laughs> <laughs> Knock his ass. Karate like, chop it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> that was way too low. Yeah, it was. That was down it, the it really was, that but I was going to let you live it. Yeah. I was going to let you live it. That was... Can I, can I have a mulligan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You need to work on your karate chops. Listen, <laughs> listen, one step at a time. Anyway, we do. We need to do that before the baby gets here because there's no excuse why we don't. Here's my thing. Oh, there's always a thing. Why? So here's why before we end break? this. Before we end this. So if I go into the bathroom at two a.m. tonight to pee and I slip, I fall, I crack my head on the on the tub, and I die. That's an accident. Are you going to be like, "Oops, fate"? He is a motherfucker. See, I, I think 
Cute. Yeah, he's a My thought process that's, is that's an accident. I slipped on the floor and I cracked my head open and I well, died. I mean, okay, but that's different. That's called a freaking accident. Yeah, it was an accidental death. Why do you want to focus on that? Or was it? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> we got that on I'm record. Joking. I know. It Don't was either me or Steven. I don't know. Look at the Chris go. <laughs> <laughs> I feel really bad if you fall tonight. I swear I will. Um, it's predetermined. Because he can fall easily a little bit. I can fall easily. Um, but we do need to do it. I would love it. I w- I'm serious. I would. And like I said, for many reasons, like I. It would be your best night in Charlotte. Yeah, Ever. we can go to like a rooftop bar or something like that. Yes. Like, just get some yes. pictures. You can do your TikTok talkies. Yeah. Yes, let's do. You it. don't really do TikTok anymore, really. Well, I think I need get to. Back into it. I, I know I need it. to. I know I we did. Lo- we had a. We have a lot of good memories. You also have a lot of like shit that's happening this year that may be impacted because like when you are like really getting into it, coronavirus wasn't here yet. Yeah. Well, or it no, was here, but it, like it, we weren't locked, shut down well, yet. Well, when that's I, when, when we you st- first told me. No, no, we not when we first got on. Pretty hot during. Not the when we first got on TikTok because that was Christmas that was January, time. Yeah. yeah, December, January. January but we and really then it shut, took yeah. it shut down like totally. Then we started getting like it. Sh- it we but started your big picking video up in that February. Had millions like hit before it shut down. Mine did too. Because I yeah. came. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right Mine, about you're that right. part. Yeah, so you're like, imagine if like life hadn't been impacted. Like, you know, it could be different. You could still be enjoying that. Yeah, we'd have quit our jobs too. I would not have. I'd be ticked. I'm famous. telling you, when, what, like that's another thing, like not not having accountability. Ooh, mm-hmm. that we can talk about that next time. Yeah. Next time, yeah. accountability. Yeah. And fate. Accountability and fate. In Charlotte. The fate and of Char- accountability. That would be really fun. I'm gonna do it. I, that would be a blast. Yeah. Yeah. Would. We would have so much fun. So much more, but like, yeah, I'm always late. I'm literally always late. People, if there's anyone out there still, they can attest. I'm always late. That's okay. Always. We love I'll be like, anyway. I'll be one at six o'clock tonight. I'll be, I'll see y'all at six o'clock. Like, bitch, I'll see you at eight. And yeah. you're eight to come. <laughs> like, hey! <laughs> Watch out! I'm two hours late. Yeah. I'm just kidding. No, but that'd be fun. Maybe we can do it in June or something. Okay. Let me, let me see. Yeah, yeah, that's perfect. Let me see if anybody out there, like, has a question. I don't know who's all watching right now. Oh, there's 25 of y'all. Hey, Victoria. Hey, do y'all have any? Is anybody out there that has a question for them or anything or us? He has one shoe on, one shoe off. Yeah, I have one off. I love it. Sexy. Before, like, I end it, anybody at all? Because I didn't see. And whoever sent those stars, I appreciate it. Make sure I see it's totally tomorrow. We do need to start going live more. Yes, we do. Maybe tomorrow night. Maybe. How are you? Yeah, I just making sure. Just making sure. Just making sure. Just making sure. I don't think there are any. Okay. All right. Oh, Natasha. TikTok Natasha is. is king on this, by the way. She loves y'all. Aww. Aww. Uh, Natasha is King Slayer's wife. Oh, fun. Yeah, she's. What's up, Natasha? Uh, hey, Natasha. It's Ange Fitco. A N G F I T C O on TikTok. I'm I'm King Hefe twenty one on everything. K I N G J E F E two one. Yes. So Ange A N G F I T C O. Right. That's it. That's it. And That's it. Code, TikTok. On everything. On yeah. everything. And then King Hefe. 21. 21. That's it. Okay. Hey, guys. Okay, but yeah, we're ending. I've been here the whole time. Aw! Natasha's been here the whole time. Aww. What? Aww. I'm okay. sorry. <laughs> Why do you do that? It's fate. Oh, my gosh. Thank you, Natasha. I, hate you. <laughs> I know. Actually, I'm over you. Oh, yeah, and the podcast. Make sure you all check out the podcast. If you go on any of like, the podcasts. It's um, in the closet, and y'all should tell them quickly why. It's not. It's it's called in the closet for a reason. Um, it's not what you think. Um, but it is because we have four kids, and at the time, two dogs and three cats, and the only <laughs> place we could go to do a podcast was in our closet, which we're in our bedroom right now. But we have a closet back in here into our bathroom that we would close ourselves in three doors deep into our closet and actually do our podcast in our closet. Because that's is where it was quiet. Made a great studio. You know, you got the clothes. But then the Jeff's shoes started stinking. I was like, dude. I what? Uh, we got to get out of here. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I was about to be like, yes, tell it. Let it out. No, I'm just kidding. I'm joking. We just. It like, just got too hot. Well, I think we were in there this summer. And it and was it like, I put a fan in there. And and then we started having guests. And like, I was it like. It got creepy. Was, like, a little weird, creepy. He's like, come, like, come to our office. Come to our closet. Come to our closet. Come hang out. Um, so, and then like our kids got a little bit older, so they got quieter and they, you know, so it's just, it's worked out. So now we're out here and yeah. 
with this little handy thing, we can go anywhere. So we can bring this can bring to Charlotte, to yes. crush it. I can't wait. I can't either. Hopefully in June. But thanks for sharing your live with us. Yeah, no, it's exciting. It's that was exciting. nice. And we're about to do something else. Like, I just love this too much. Yeah. Like, I want to like do this more. I know. I do too. You know what you can do? We can go by phone. You dial in, and this cuts out the background. Like you, it's literally it's like, like you're, you're sitting here. Phone. We plug it. You're you're. We plug a cord in here, and I hook it to my phone. You call my phone. So we could, but do it that comes too. through this and through the mics and everything. Okay. Well, whenever literally, we could do that. Like whenever. you can call in, and it'll sound like you're sitting right here with us. Whenever y'all want me to do that, I'll do that. We'll do that soon. <laughs> but for now, we're gonna we're peace ready. out. Okay. This is it. Great. I'll be back. Yes. Yeah, Thanks for right. coming, Michael. Peace out. <laughs>